ICS comm check. Roger. I'm closing the canopy. Ready to start. No zig. Departure runway 03 right. Arrival runway 21 left. Visual approach is in use. Advise on initial contact you have information alpha. Nellis information alpha. 1345 Zulu. Wing 210 at 10 knots. Visibility greater than 10 miles. Sky clear. Temperature 70. Dew point three two. Altimeter two nine or six three. No zig. Departure runway zero three right.
Ah, ready to taxi. Chief, remove the wheel chocks. Copy. Wheel chocks are now removed. Factor 3, ready. Nose clearance out, 142 flight, ready to copy clearance to North Warren with information Alpha. Outlaw 42, nose clearance, cleared North Warren via the Dream 2 departure, then it's file. Squawk 6001 sequential, departure frequency will be 273.55. Squawk 6001 sequential, departure 273.55, Outlaw 42. Outlaw 42, read back correct. Contact ground on 275 decimal 8 prior to taxi. Outlaw 42. Outlaw 42, flight go button 3. Outlaw check. 2. Dallas ground, Outlaw 42, flight ready for taxi with Alpha.
Attention to brief. This is the first flight of the Zone 5 campaign. The scenario is 1v1, one fighter versus one bandit. Sniper 3, you will be fighting Gator in Outlaw 4-2, and after this briefing you can get together with him for details. To simplify maintenance support, we only brought our F-16s and F-5s on this debt, so you will not see the A-4 Skyhawk. On this first flight, you'll face the F-5 Tiger II, which is a good simulator of the MiG-21. As far as weapons, both aircraft will use internal guns only. This will provide you with the most engaged time and the most intense learning experience. You've already had the Nellis Course Rules Lecture, so you should be comfortable operating here. But since this is your first flight of the program, Gator will be the lead. Your call sign will be Outlaw 42-2. The bandit will only lead this event. In the future, you or your wingman will be the flight lead. Before you arrive at the range, you will need to perform a G-Awareness Maneuver, or G-Warm. This is a requirement before every ACM training flight. I'm sure you do them in your squadron, and here's what we expect. You will be flying at least 300 knots preferably 350. When cleared, slide out two miles of beam. When you're stabilized, begin a smooth, firm pull to at least 4G and hold it for 90 degrees of turn. In case you're wondering, turn towards your flight lead. Ease the G in reverse, then again pull to at least 4G. 
Be sure to maintain sight throughout these maneuvers. When you've completed your second turn, call complete on the radio. Gator will knock out his G-Awareness maneuver when he can. Gator will check in with Blackjack, the range controller, and Showtime, the range training officer, at Gate 4, Bighorn. Then you will proceed to Point India. Once in the area, Gator will establish you at 23,000 feet and 350 knots. He will tell you to take separation and you'll move out to 1.5 miles. When you are established and ready to begin the fight, call Speed and Angels. Gator will then call for tape recorders and fights on. Give it your best turn in to accomplish the head-on pass. I'm sure you've already thought about your game plan, but be ready to evaluate what the bandit is doing. He may make a move that causes you to change your plan. Your F-14 is superior to the F-5 in almost every measure, but he can challenge you by giving up energy for angles, to intimidate you, or maybe get a shot, and by taking advantage of any mistakes you make. If the F-5 appears to be gaining, evaluate his energy as discussed in the 1v1 lecture. I hope you watch that video in preparing for this program. We expect you to operate as a crew. Rios, be ready to operate the dogfight modes of the radar, to tell your pilot airspeed, or do whatever it takes to make your Tomcat more lethal. In future events, we'll have a scenario and you'll be assigned a fighter mission, but not this time. The purpose of this flight is to concentrate on your close-in maneuvering skills. The first fight will continue until Gator calls knock it off, unless you experience a safety issue or run low on fuel then you can call knock it off. After the knock it off, Gator will get a fuel check from you and then expect to re-establish the start parameters for the second engagement. When Gator calls RTB, join up and he will lead you back to Nellis. Remember, go ahead and switch the master arm on and actually take the shot at the bandit. It's a game and it's cool to blow stuff up. And the bandit pilot, well he'll be okay and he'll join you later at the club. Good luck. Let's review the training rules. We need 5 miles visibility and 15,000 feet between cloud layers. Hard deck is 500 feet. Soft deck is 5,000 feet. There's no slow speed, high AOA maneuvering below the soft deck. Of note, these numbers are for the game. The decks in actual flying are higher. You need to perform a G-Awareness maneuver before starting ACM. All aircraft need operable UHF and ICS if two-seaters, and must monitor guard. Nordo aircraft, rock your wings and proceed to Coyote B, orbit at 15,000 feet. If no one joins on you, follow the Nordo recovery procedures in the in-flight guide. Remember, monitor showtime and blackjack frequencies while on the range. There's a 500-foot bubble around all aircraft. 9,000 feet is the minimum for head-on aim nine shots. There's a 1,000-foot minimum for guns, and no head-on gunshots. Head-on, pass left to left, but don't cross flight path to get there. Nose high aircraft goes high. Upsun aircraft is responsible for collision avoidance. Offensive aircraft, monitor the altitude of a defensive aircraft. Don't make blind lead turns. Echo all knock it off calls. Someone's approaching guns on you, dispense fuel. An additional note, Monitor your fuel closely, and remember we have two tankers on station if you get low on fuel. The details are on your kneeboard cards. There's no need to push the limits. Now take a minute to go through the stall spin procedures for your aircraft.
Sniper 3, G Warm.
to our surface target. Nine o'clock. Eight o'clock. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock low. Three o'clock low. Looking like three ten. Twelve o'clock low. Twelve 
12 o'clock high. 380 knots. 420 and blazing. One o'clock low. Speed 470. We're fast at 510. And that's 480. Six o'clock. Three o'clock. Twelve o'clock. Six o'clock. Speed 380. 320, keep it steady. Twelve o'clock. Passing 350. Light him up, he's right in front of us, closing. 320. One o'clock low. Good flying, we're on a six. Speed 370. Four, 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 440, uh, four, no, 430. 460. He's dead ahead, man. Come on, show me some of that pilot shit. We're fast at 510. He's ours now. Shoot, it down. shoot him, shoot him. Two, knock it off. Snap for three, knock it off. 10 o'clock. 480 knots. Bandit is going down. Sniper 3, good job. Now proceed to India and rejoin at Angels 2 3. Sniper 3, will go. Bandit, bra, 270, 22 miles.
Pucker time. Roger. He's locked. Target, 14 miles. That's a F5. Target, four miles. And that's 400. We're on a six. Nice job. Shoot him. He's right there. Closing. Good flying, we're on a six, closing. Speed 370. He's ours now, closing. Shoot him, shoot him! 340. Two o'clock. Nine o'clock high. Establish a separation of a mile and a half, a beam on my right side, then call when ready. Nine o'clock. Sniper three will go. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. Sniper three, speed and angels on the right. Outlaw four two, speed and angels on the left. Recorders on, flights on. Twelve o'clock. Passing three ninety. Twelve o'clock. Six o'clock low. Speed, 290. Eleven o'clock low. Okay, that's 230. Speed, 260. And that's 300. Passing 340. 12 o'clock low. Three o'clock high. 310 knots. 11 o'clock low.
coming up on 400. Uh, 450. I smell a kill soon. We're on a six. 490, almost 500 now. Keep it up. We're on a six. 440. Let's go. Speed 360. 330 knots. We're on a six. 360 knots. Passing 410. 490, ease it. He's on our nose, keep him there. Five five zero knots. Five hundred. Twelve o'clock. Trigger down. There's four fifty. Eleven o'clock low. Four hundred. Three seven zero knots. Twelve o'clock high. Speed three three zero. He's ours now. Two eight zero knots. Shoot him! Shoot him! I smell a kill soon. We're on a six. Three twenty. Needle showing three fifty. Six. Burn that sucker! Speed 380. Shoot him! You got it! Four three zero knots. He's dead ahead, man. 470. Trigger down. And that's 510. You have him now. Ooh, there's 480. Turn it down. 12 o'clock. We're bingo fuel. 430. We're at 370. Four hundred. Four thirty. Twelve o'clock, twelve o'clock. Speed four seven zero. Oh. He's right in front of you. Light him up, he's right in front of us. He's right in front of you. We're at 400 knots. Turn it down. Nice, 370. And that's 430. 480. We're fast at 510. Turn her down. 10 o'clock. On a six, keep it up. Speed 450. 420 blaze it. We're on a six. Snap a three, knock it off. He's dead ahead, dead ahead. Oh, man. 
The bandit is down. Mexico, one, one. Pontiac, one, one. Request rejoin. Lock to friendly. Target, 10 miles.
Ready, recontact. Clear contact. Just a bit to the left. Little right. Glug, glug, glug! Fuel, 1,500. thousand. Fuel four thousand. Abort rejoin. Fuels bingo! Roger. Yes, sir. Switching to fixed point. You've spiked a friendly! Target, four miles. It's a friendly! We locked a friendly!
Target, three miles. Gotcha. Switching to stew point two. There is a uh, there is a friendly bra. One five five forty three miles. Angels eight.
Teachers seem complex. Don't worry, you'll get used to them. You'll have a few relatively quiet minutes each flight while you RTB. Take the time to think about how it went and get yourself ready for the debrief. Think about your game plan. You should always start with a game plan, although you may have to adjust it once things get going. Was it a good plan? How well did you execute? How well did you adjust? In this 1v1, did Gator show you any surprises? The F-14 is superior to the F-5, but Gator knows a few tricks that can intimidate a Tomcat pilot in Rio if they don't have good SA of their own energy state and the F-5's energy. The debrief will go over the flight in detail and will emphasize learning points. It's an extremely valuable part of the fighter tactics and weapons program. Switching to steer point three. Approach. 
Comanche 558 at Papa, three miles south of Malapa. Requesting Bravo transition to North Las Vegas Airport. Let's go. Tex 11 North Approach, Roger. Reduce speed, maintain 250 knots. Wings are twinning. 
Auto gears down, sass on, flaps full, DLC engaged, checked, hooked up, harness locked, boards out, spoiler brake selected, fuel checked. Sniper 3, no one's power, clear the active via Bravo, contact ground. Sniper 3, will go. You're way too fast. 